I have just three questions to ask. And if they are true, tell me. If they are not, also tell me. Question number one. Did you know that there are more widows than widowers? Question number two. Did you know that most husbands' deaths are stress-related? Question number three. Did you also know that most wives do not know that their husbands are doing so much for the family until the poor man is dead and gone? Listen, until they lost their husbands, that is when most wives realize the enormity of responsibility their husbands we are carrying. Have you seen why you need to support your husband? especially when you see that he's trying. Not only that, still give him peace because he needs it. He needs it to stay long for you because I don't get it, I don't understand. As in how can an African man with all kinds of loads and responsibilities be expected to be as romantic as an American man? Tell me, are men not trying? Women, please give your husband support, respect, and the peace at home so they can live long. Do not contribute to his downfall because you are going to suffer it when he's no more. Learn to encourage your husband and stop being sarcastic to him. Please, except you don't want to join the widow's club early. The choice is yours to decide on what you want. But note that Widow's Club is not funny. You can ask the members. Listen, be a helper, be submissive, and they stop nagging. Build your home and marriage, because it is not green out there. Don't be deceived. If your husband has a long life to live, help him live longer, so he doesn't die before his time. Avoid rushing to join the Widow's Club, except you want to join. Let me be honest with you. Men are physically stronger but die easily from too much burdens. Don't let it come from you. Don't. Let me tell you why I like to advise my fellow gender. It is because I love them so much. You see women, I love women so, so much. But it will be difficult for you to believe me. Our people say that it's people we love we advise, isn't it? I'm only interested in opening your eyes to see the major things to work on because I want your happiness. I want you to be happy. After all, nobody is perfect, including men and women. I don't talk about before. If only you know the heart of your husband, it could be like say you use Juju Holam. It's your home. Generally and naturally, men no get too much problem. I mean, they tell you. If you understand them, you're going to say they no get wahala. Follow these tips I am giving you and enjoy your marriage. At least to avoid had I know. For the fact that they don't have problems doesn't mean there are no foolish ones. But if you have a good man in your life, support him. Care for him. Love him. Always pet him because they love it. Care for him like a baby. Prepare good meals for him. And they tell me why such a man no go live long. Why such a man go use to play? Unless you're married and ingrate. So be wise. Don't kill him with your nagging attitude. So I pray for you including myself may god almighty who sees and knows everything help us to be a helper to our husbands through christ our lord amen love yourself because you are a limited edition thank you